The war of the Superman continues in New Superman issue 14. Emperor Superman's reign continues this issue as the superpowered despot rallies his villain army to do battle with the Great Ten. Keenan and the rest of the Justice League of China, meanwhile, are helping the injured people of Shanghai and aiding in the rescue efforts, while Keenan learns a little bit more about Batman and Wonder Woman's relationship. Amanda Waller monitors the situation, contacting the Suicide Squad, whom are in Shanghai, for a mission. Waller gives them some much needed credit tonight so the situation doesn't get out of control. Told that there are civilians stuck inside Shanghai Tower, Keenan springs into action, uh, devising a plan for his team to stealthily get the hostages out before confronting Superman Zero. I Ching also arrives but becomes crippled with pain, telling Keenan that he has his own battle to fight. The old master then enters a meditative state where he then faces off against his quote unquote Brother. Superman and his team launch their attack, defeating the Freedom Fighters before Wonder Woman finally retakes her full human form, allowing Batman to profess his love for her. Keenan leaves the team when he discovers his father's heartbeat. Finding his father and mother, he frees them, and his father confirms that Dr. Omen is indeed his mother. Leaving his parents with Robin Bot to escape the building, Keenan confronts Superman Zero, whom he easily defeats thanks to the clone being distracted by the battle around him. Zero fires his heat vision on Keenan, who thanks to his persistence is able to call up his own more powerful heat vision, stopping Zero in his tracks. Before he realizes what is happening, Zero is killed by Deadshot and his Kryptonite sword, which begins weakening Keenan as well. New Superman issue 14 finally saw Keenan leading the Justice League of China into a proper battle and using all of his lessons he has learnt to inspire and lead the team against Superman Zero. It's really quite awesome to see how much of a character Keenan has grown in the past 14 issues and how much he's changed. Superman Zero unfortunately died this issue which is a shame since I was kind of betting on him kind of becoming Keenan's Bizarro or Keenan's General Zod or something. I thought it was going to stick around and maybe pop up every now and then for Keenan to fight but guess he died and it also sucks because we never really got much of him this issue and he was barely in it. The Suicide Squad turned up however and seemed to be in conflict with Keenan so that's going to be quite interesting to see what happens there and whether Walla wants to actually kill him or try and recruit him for the Suicide Squad since she no longer has General Zod on her payroll. I'm going to give this issue a 7.5 out of 10. Hey everyone, thanks for watching my newest video. If you enjoyed it, you might also like to check out my other reviews here on my channel. You can also follow me on various social media platforms like Twitter by searching Matt underscore FOS or even join the Comic Multiverse Discord server and chat with other comic book fans including myself and Joel from Cape Joel. Want cheap comics and trades? Head over to the book depository with the link in the description to get the cheapest trades and comics around, along with free shipping anywhere in the world. Until next time, this has been Matt of the Fortress of Solitude, thank you so much for watching.